Hey everybody, Kelly Ritchie here. Let's jam. The track we're gonna look at today is in the key of A minor. We're gonna be using an A Aeolian mode. Now, when I play the chords A minor seven to an F major seven, that really gives you a nice melodic structure to play over. If I'm doing my A minor seven, and I put that nine or the two on top, that's a great note to add into your minor pentatonic. It's one of the notes in the A Aeolian. Now all the notes in the F major seven are found in your minor pentatonic. Now your F major seven adds this note to the A minor pentatonic. Here's what the pattern looks like. Now, if you're new to modes, but you really know your way around the pentatonics, just add those extra two notes. When you add that note there, there's its octave. There's one of the notes, there's a second note. Now when you're starting to play this, put on the rhythm track and don't play a thing, just make sure that you feel the groove, okay? Then you can hit the rhythm track. And just play quarter notes along. And if you ever feel like you're tightening up or tensing up, just turn your volume all the way down to where you've got freedom. Down up, down up, down up, down up. But just start with quarter notes. And then once you really feel that, you can start playing rhythm. So once you've gotten the quarter notes, and then turn your volume down if you need to. Three, four. Down up, down up, down up, down up. Down up, 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 down up. See how I'm creating a pulse? And don't hesitate to stop a track and work on the mechanics at your own speed speed or tempo. Then put the track back on and you may need to just let the whole track play and just feel the rhythm. It depends on where you are in your journey as a guitar player, okay? So make sure you feel it first. Then you can start by practicing your pentatonics if that's all that you know at this stage because this whole series is about making sure you know the pentatonics and adding two more notes to give you more freedom, okay? Now I'm gonna just start the track where it is and I'm gonna show you how you can practice your pentatonics to this, then your modes. Now if you're new to pentatonics, you can just play quarter notes. You can just play the A minor pentatonic basic. Then you can 
expanded. But I'm feeling it. Then you can start adding some vibrato to some of the notes. into it. that you are. Practice your pentatonics in their basic form and their expanded form, then add the extra two notes. <laughs> then you can go up to your root five. And you can do the whole process over again. Hit the rhythm track, play the basic A minor pentatonic root five, but make sure that you feel it, okay? Then you can expand it. then you can start breathing some life into it, okay? And if you have your pentatonics down and that's not a problem, well then you'll be starting this process further along. You can look at this through the lens of the 50 Licks series where you take the Dive into this rhythm track. Make sure that you have your quarter notes down, that you're feeling the groove. Make sure that you have the rhythm guitar down. Then practice your pentatonics to it. Practice your modes to it. And just let the music come to you. Make sure that whatever you do, you do it with feel. If you played the most basic, simple version of any of this with a ton of feel, that's gonna sound great. If you try to play a bunch of notes or fancy rhythm and it's not really deep in the pocket, it's not gonna sound as good. Never underestimate the power of simplicity, okay? The complexities will come. So as you practice, you can expand your abilities both melodically and technically. But no matter what you do, make sure you feel it. <laughs> because if you don't feel it, nobody feels it, okay? So dive in, have fun, and let's jam. <laughs> 